What's up everybody? Justice Good here and in this tutorial I'm going to show you how to create the Apollo effect from the popular iPhone and Android application Instagram. So this is the final effect that I've created in Photoshop and as you can see it adds a, a kind of desaturated green tone and the most noticeable effect is it overlays like the image of stars or some type of space scene in the background. So how to recreate this is pretty simple. It just takes a few steps. So first off, find the photo that you want to use. Here is my original photo. Now the first thing you want to do is go to Filter, Lens Correction, which is right here. And then under the Custom tab, you're going to go to vignette which is the third box and just take the slider and darken it a bit so we're just going to create a small vignette now for our next step you want to go to layer new adjustment layer black and white now on this layer you're just going to turn the opacity down to fifty percent Now we're going to add another adjustment layer after we've desaturated the colors a little bit to add that green tone. So go to layer, new adjustment layer, photo filter. Under the filter, select green and keep preserved luminosity checked and turn the density up to 50%. You can adjust the exact percentage higher or lower depending on your picture and the same thing with the black and white. You can turn the opacity of this layer from anywhere from like 50 to 70 percent depending on how you want the effect to look. But I'm just going to keep it at 50 and 50 here. Now for the final and most important step uh, you want to find a picture of a star scene or stars on the internet. I found a picture of this galaxy here on stock exchange and I'll link this in the description below so you can use this exact one and what you want to do is drag this on top of your image and then first off we want to desaturate it so go to image adjustments desaturate and then second you want to go to edit transform and scale it or you can use command T so I'm going to hold shift here to constrain proportions and scale it down to more of a usable size on my photo. A little too small. Okay. So now that I've brought it back up, all you want to do is set this layer to color dodge. And you can position it. You can play with the positioning so you can get it how you like but now for one final step we want to add a border so I'm gonna to go to layer new layer grab my rectangular marquee tool here select the whole image right click stroke inside I'm using 30 pixels but depending on the size of your image you want to have it so that it's it's about it's a pretty thick border so if you have a really small image 30 might be too much but you'll see in a second just change the color instead of white just drag it a little bit down to like off white and location inside everything else is good so as you can see I'll right click and deselect there it's it's a pretty thick border from in proportion to your image it should be about that thick so instead of 30 pixels use whatever fits for your image size but overall that's our final effect there so here's the original and here's the Apollo effect and it really adds a cool spacey feel to it so try it out with a photo of your own and let me know what you think